I think before hits, my life was full of ups and downs. My early life, I didn't have my mother around, but thankfully I had quite a lot of sisters. Growing up, I was most of the time playing by myself and quite closed off, introverted in a way. And in year eight, I believe, just towards the end, I was moved to Gambia due to some of my sisters not being able to take care of me, you know. And I spent about two years in Gambia. And uh, when I came back, I didn't resume any kind of education. I just kind of closed myself off to the world. I was referred to the HITS program by the Creative Youth Network through my support worker. And during that time, I was really keen to, to get into rugby and kind of, you know, explore the game a bit more. And the idea of having rugby and education in one package was exactly what I wanted. For me, the HITS program has given me confidence, direction in life, and cheesy enough, cheesy as it may be, um, a family, you know. When I originally started HITS, went down a very dark road, very depressed. I didn't take part in anything. I, I've got asthma, so I was very lack of that. So I was always having asthma attacks, very bad, didn't want to take any time in sports. And I was just generally down and out because I lacked confidence and the ingenuity to actually talk to someone who I've never met before. Matt and Mike have been there to support me in everything of that aspect when I was on HITS. So they kept on giving me help and support to always take part in something, always try something new. And by the progression in it, by the end of it, I was ecstatic. I loved doing sports. I could be myself again. When I was on HITS, I had so much fun, had so many friends. I did loads of things I was really happy with, but now it helps me progress in life. I've learned new life skills. I've gained more attention. I've expanded my horizons to be better than I was when I once started. So my life before HITS was, uh, was I kind of just found it tough because I've got autism, so I found it kind of very tough to just deal with and learn to kind of cope with that. Um, I kind of was very shy, just didn't get on at school or anything. Just I kind of refused to go places if it meant that I had to speak to certain people I didn't know. So I knew that I kind of wanted to do something in sport, but I kind of didn't know how to get into it. So I like, came to HITS and Gareth and Louis gave me the support to, you know, kind of uh, kind of set up some doing some sport activities kind of at HITS. Um, so I've been coaching now for two years with uh, my local club called St Martins. Um, I've had another seven teams now and um, yeah I got into that a couple of years ago and it's I really enjoy it. You kind of see in the progress from where they started to where they are kind of now it like amazes me to see kind of how how people or children especially can just develop their skills and everything in, a, in the space of a year. Sport was always kind of like my little escape from kind of general life. Um, so sport has helped me kind of improve my confidence in all that um, and improve really like my communication with everyone. 